Hi, right, how's it going, everybody? I'm picking up right where I left off, and, uh, get away, chicken! Be gone! Stay safe! <laughs> okay. Probably a little unnecessary, but, uh, I think that- I think that first one was probably gonna get hit. And I don't want to hurt chickens. They're kind of... weird, adorable. Or cuckoos, or whatever they are. Whatever they're technically called. Um... So yeah, there's a couple other chests I think I can get. I think there's one in here. Oh, or there's just a dude that's set up shot in a little uh, chicken coop. Cool. Uh, you know what? Let's pick up some bombs. I'm gonna need them to uh, get the other items I'm thinking about anyway. I also don't remember... You know, I should... Pr oh, this is the one with the back door. I think. Oh, yeah, there we go. And you've got a chest. What do you got? Wonderful! <laughs> Those rupees help in no way whatsoever. Literally, it's... Uh, it's an item that you can just grind for and kill enemies for. Um, I already talked to you. I don't have enough rupees. Not yet, anyway. I'll get them eventually. I remember there being an item or two up in the Lost Woods. I just don't remember where. Oh god, no, be gone. Thank you. Um, who knows? I might die horribly in here. I may never be heard from again. But, gonna have to explore it eventually. There's a dude right there. There's a creepy dude, just chill. No, no, be gone. <laughs> Thank you. I remember, uh, I just vaguely remember them, uh, they chase you. Oh my Jesus Christ, what are you? Okay. We got people hiding in the bushes. The hammer. Okay. That is not a good weapon. I mean, it is really, really powerful. It's just really small and really hard to hit things with. <laughs> so, I do technically have a weapon that hurts some enemies. Oh. I didn't know that was there. Oh well, we'll see what's in there. Hopefully I didn't just soft lock. Oh. Rupees. Ah, is there anything back here before I jump through? There's nothing. Okay. But yeah, I was actually heading for... Actually, I think this is the other side of... Have you seen Andy? He was out looking for our prize ether medallion. I wonder when he'll be back. Never. Um... I think this will actually take me out. Yeah, okay, so yeah, I was just up there. I was actually trying to get in here. Uh, oh god, oh god, no, not another one of you. Because I don't think I can kill those guys. Oh, sweet Jesus, why? Um, oh god, I just walked into a landmine. That's cool. Alright. Oh god, oh god, okay, okay, I'm seconds from death. I have to be very careful and run from everything. Also, I am... still basically helpless. I know there's a cave in there, but I need the torch to actually get through. <laughs> this is not looking very good at all. I'm also not going the way I wanted to go. I meant to go south, because there's a couple things down there I can, uh... A couple passages I can use bombs to open up. What's in here? Hey! Oh! Uh, super bombs, mega bombs, smart bombs, I don't remember what they're called. I think those are like an end game Metroid weapon though, so if I can actually get those, I just need the torch so I can actually navigate through the, uh, the cave. The maze cave thing. One of us always lies. One of us always tells the truth. All right, cool. The one minor thing with your riddle, uh, yes, with your riddle, um, one small thing with your riddle that, uh, you have failed to realize is, uh, I don't really care. So, yeah. I don't think that a riddle is actually... The... In the process of the randomizing, some character's dialogue gets, uh, changed, I guess, is... The only way I can think of putting it, and I actually need to get down there. But I don't want to go through the swarm of, uh... 
Oh, would you listen to that sweet, sweet, maddening beeping of low health? <sighs> Let me play you the song of my people. You only get a minor break from it in between uh, loading screens. Or until you heal. Really? A key? Alright, so... This is actually the end of a dungeon. I don't know why... I actually didn't think this was part of the dungeon. Um, Yeah, this is the exit of it. You actually have to go through... I can go through the castle. Maybe. I do have a hammer, so I guess I can kill things in there. It won't be pretty, but I can. Oh god. I actually don't think I can... Okay, if I hit them from behind with a hammer... <laughs> I can kill them. Oh boy. So in other words, I'm still basically helpless. Oh, this is gonna be... This is gonna be very interesting. But that's kind of what... This is kind of what makes it sort of exciting. Was this a thing? I think there might be an item. Oh, there's a bomb. Okay, never mind. Because I really don't know where I'm going to go or how I'm even going to go about, like, trying to progress. At least not, you know, not past, like, the next two minutes of the game. Or however long it takes me to actually go, um, check out these caves. Could be five minutes. It could be four hours. All depends on, uh, how brutal this game wants to be. Alright, what item do we have in here? A single rupee! Cool. I never have to come back here. Unless I'm in desperate need of one rupee. Yeah. Just the one. For anyone who doesn't know, uh, green rupees are worth one. Red, I think, are worth five. Blue are worth ten. Or twenty. I don't remember. They change between a couple games. Do you come from my brother's room? Are we cool? Sure. In the original game, uh, the two brothers got angry at each other and uh, decided to um, seal up the wall or door in between their rooms, so... Yeah. You have 15... Oh, God. Um, I just realized I don't have a weapon to cut these things down, so I might not actually be able to make it, even with the shortcut. <gasps> the power glove! Oh, cool. I made it. All right, so the power glove allows me to pick up rocks. Get past uh, certain little areas, so that'll actually... <gasps> I can get in the dark world. Holy shit, I can get into the dark world. I think. I think I can get into the dark world. If I can get into the dark world, I just opened up a lot of more options for me to... Uh... Basically a lot more potential for me to get items. Um, maybe. <laughs> I don't want to overstate what that might mean, but it might mean, it might mean, I can actually, uh... No guarantees of progressing, I was going to say progress, but really it just means there's more potential for me to find items. So that I can progress. So I just want to check this out real quick. Over here there is a portal that I think I need the hammer and the gloves. At least I think the portal's over here. I really don't remember. All right. Into the dark world we go. Why did I do that? I don't have the mirror. I am stuck eternally in the dark world for the rest of time. And I can't... Because... Okay, so... Small little bit of story. Or plot or whatever. Um... When you go into the dark world, your true self is revealed. Um, basically, you become the essence of what and who you are. So Link, the poor helpless child, who is trying to save the princess, turns into a bunny man. A very helpless, useless bunny man who can't do anything. So in order to retain your true form, I think you need you need some item that allows you to stay human in the dark world. So while I can get into the dark world, 
I can't do anything in the dark world is basically what that means, which really sucks. Oh, wonderful. Eh, that's actually not bad. Because <sighs> I can come back there to heal at any point, so... Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, uh, be gone. Oh god, I... I'm just gonna pause the game and pretend that didn't happen and uh, pick this up in the next episode. Bye, everyone. <laughs>